Hi guys, in this tutorial I'm going to be showing you how to create a circular text view. Right click on your drawable folder and create a new XML file. I named this file text underscore view underscore circle and inside of this file we're going to create a shape and we're going to need the opening and closing tags. Our shape is going to need three attributes, a solid color, a stroke, and rounded corners. Think of all views as rectangles. To convert a rectangle to a circle, all sides of the rectangle must be equal, and if we round the corners, we can get a perfect circle. I chose to set the corner radius of all corners as 50 dp. Once this is done, we go into the XML file which contains our text view and set the background to our drawable file. It is very important that the width and length of our text view be set to the same values. If we use wrap content or match parent, it will not work. Also set the gravity to center so that the text view will be in the center of your circle. I'm going to go a little bit further in this tutorial and add a countdown timer to this text view. The text view will need an ID so that it can be referenced in our main activity. I chose to add a countdown timer because in previous tutorials, I showed you how to create a quiz in Android Studio. The only thing missing from the quiz was a countdown timer. The code for the countdown timer can be obtained from the Google Developers website. I have added a link in the description. The 30,000 refers to time in milliseconds. When we divide it by 1,000, we get the time in seconds, which will be 30 seconds. You will see the word done after the time has elapsed. If you enjoyed this tutorial, hit the like button, and to see more Android Studio tutorials, hit subscribe. As always, thanks for watching.